Hello, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Rants 4.2. It's good to be back. It's actually been a, like, maybe like 10 days since I last played, though obviously it seems normal. I mean, I guess it is, it does release every week, so it's kind of normal. But for me, it feels longer than usual, I guess, just as I was doing some other stuff. But it's good to be back. I do have some, some tech, tech here. Because I remember reading stuff last week, because after I did the video, I went back to the wiki, but I didn't open it now, but like suddenly it just like boomed in my mind. So from what I remember, the coins, the, or I don't know what, what are there? We have like, we have some sort of currency and we, I didn't know what they were for, but apparently they're for like a, a gotcha machine where you can get rants for CGs or um, from another old Alice Soft game. And if you collect them all, you get a special CG. Uh, we're probably not going to be collecting them all. But once we find it, I, I don't mind rolling once or however many coins we got. Another point is we do need to go back outside just to that um we have a special item called the lunch, which refills our stamina, but we can only use it for the first half of the game. And, um, yeah, so whenever we go back outside, we should use it. It's nice and handy, but also, um, the dog guy that we met, apparently you just find him by following the sound of the dogs when you go to the entrance, which we kind of already figured out, but he drops coins. There's like a method you can do where you can knock him out and not kill him and farm coins like that, but we want to fight him at least once. I don't really care about farming coins. Um, you can get an item from pharmaceutical. I don't, I don't know where exactly, but somewhere there. Um, that's like a droppable item when you're just exploring the base and But that's like droppable, right? So you kind of go there if you don't find it in the base or whatever But I mean If we're going outside we might as well get it if you don't have it already. I don't actually remember what it was, but Yeah, and finally apparently we can get a rock out of the wall at the entrance and use that to take the egg which we need to get this thing out right so lots of <laughs> lots of pieces of the puzzle so we definitely want to make our way outside but i kind of want to finish this wing first so let's just do that but yeah <laughs> lots of information to take but it all just can't kind of came back to me so i wanted to say it before i forgot <laughs> um but let's continue right you know we beat our first um one of the sailor sisters plus we still have those like three or four assassins to deal with plus arnie and archibald so lots of stuff to do but let's head east oh first enemy burn my cards good attack uh I'll try to finish him off did not finish him off Nice, nice focus. You love to see it. And then Genry doing damage for no reason. Doesn't give you bonus at SP, I think. Wonder if you can get the true ice bird sword in this game, like you could in the other one. Would be handy. But Aiden, if you get it, uh, it makes the game too easy. It's not my problem, bro. If it's in the game, you gotta use it. <laughs> or there's nothing wrong with using it. But I don't I didn't read that, so I don't actually know where it would be. Pretty good though. Gotta watch her stamina. She starts a little low, but she's fragile. Same with Genry. And once their stamina drained, well you saw what happened in the last playthrough. But luckily, it's not just Athena on our team, so we can probably manage pretty well. Even if someone gets stamina fought. Okay, just are so close to leveling. Oh, glue! I think that's what we. That's the droppable item. I'll double check once we head outside. And we got a medal. Which I think that's the casino money. Okay, glue garden. Nice. As soon as we were talking about it, I think we immediately got it. Based. What the heck's this? It's a slot machine. 
I'm aware of that. I'm asking why it's here of all places. For a chance at a fabulous prizes? Um, I'll draw a slot machine here. Beep, beep. Righty, right. Beep, beep. I did it. Well, let's play. Ransom, I don't think now's the time for. Heroes always have free time. I can't freak out like some pathetic loser. So I'm down to play. Got it? Nice. Okay. <laughs> Everything we mentioned is literally here, so... Works out, I guess. Okay. It's just a slot. Check. It's a slot machine left right out in the middle of the hallway. It's a simple game where you put meadows in, pull the lever, and if the pitcher matches up, you win prizes, but I kind of like it. Yeah, let's play it. I said I would. See if we can get some familiar rants for CGs. Or uh, from the other game. I'd rather get rants for ones, though. Just to, you know, get some memories. <laughs> Let Well, I guess I'll have a go. Let's see here. It looks like it doesn't accept money rants, don't it? It requires some sort of custom metals. I think I picked some metals up. Maybe I can use those. Items. How much do I have? Oh, I have four. Alright. Oh, I have to actually use them. Okay. Inserted the metal into the slot machine. Clack, clank, din, spin, spin. The slot machine started moving. Gal, bar, bar, guy, guy, bar, gal. Ooh, guy. <sighs> you bastard. Hey, we got a metal back. Oh, wait. I don't know how much it cost us. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh my god, it, it's RNG. For some reason in my mind, I thought it was like the gotcha machine, but it's actually RNG. Oh, I pity. I There's no way I can grind this, bro. I'd probably go crazy. But we'll play it whenever we get there. You lose. Making fun of me? No constellation prize. You hate to see it. Hmm. Uh, Unlucky, oh my god. I wonder how many CGs there are. Oop. Yeah, first gal, first gal. Win gal card. Ah, I remember Magician. She was chilling with um the Otayu Fever, one of the first enemies we fought, or boss battles. But then you see her later on. A card emerged from the bottom slot, obtain the Magician card. Okay, actually, like, 10's not bad, but I don't know if I'm actually gonna grind. Who knows, I guess I'm a little undecided, but I probably won't. But we'll come here every time and maybe we'll get lucky enough. So it's not actually CGs, I thought these were, like, hentai CGs. Ooh, easy. Oh, wait, no, there's, oh, there's 20. And I don't know what bars are, maybe bars the HCGs? Oh, uh, which makes it 30. Beef B Bambara. I recognize him from Rans 4, I think. Not from the other game. Okay, so I think there's 30. That makes it a lot harder. <laughs> well, that was fun. Got some prizes, at least. View collection. Oh, wait, no. There's only two. Maybe it's like a... A jackpot kind of thing. Anyways. There's your fun gambling. Little bit of dopamine. Let's continue this side until we're, like, stuck. I think it loops around here. We can open the door here for a shortcut, maybe. What, what, what? A bathroom hot. Dude, those urinals kind of look like handy was with giant mouths, bro. It's kind of weird. Bathroom, huh? It's a guy's bathroom. Athena 2.0 and t Sarge, and we'll have to wait outside. So let's wait outside together, Kisara-chan. Aww, uh, that's actually kinda cute. Athena 2.0 grabbed Kisara's hand and went back into the hallway. If you don't hurry, you'll turn into a boy. <laughs> Whack, I hit Athena 2.0 on the head. No, sometimes she's so adorable. That won't happen, dumbass. Owie, you hit me. Oof. Stop saying stupid shit and draw the map. Okay. Toy, let's gotta be potties. Right, righty, right. Little swan. Mmm, done. Well, oh, if you'll excuse me for a moment. Can we enter the bathroom? 
He stood in front of the fourth urinal from the right and started peeing noisily. <laughs> ah, this feels great. Shh. 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 Tinkle, tinkle. Looks like Denry's noisy pissing is over. You're so fucking loud. I always pee about three liters, so. Jesus. Ha 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 ha. It's about as much water maximum I drink a day. I'm actually pretty good at drinking water. I know, like, when people are like, oh, the recommended water you have to drink is actually probably, like, twice the amount you do. I'm actually, like, really good at it, I think. I love me some water. Okay, so it doesn't loop. So we will have to take a long way around. Well, surroundings. A room full of toilets. Urinal. Check. Men's urinals line the wall. They're all scrubbed clean, but it's not like it's filthy in here. But urinals are urinals. Okay. Do business. I don't need to yet. Mm. So nothing we can do here right now. We don't have any item. I think so. Alright, let's start our trip. Oops. Went the wrong way. Outside. We don't need to get the glue, but I'll double check in case glue is not what we need. This is. <clears throat> I think I prefer the dungeon music in uh, Rants 4.1, but this one's growing on me actually, so. Good stuff. R. I wouldn't mind one last fight since we're gonna be healing up, anyways. But, if you don't come, you don't come. Alright, let's go up then. Let's head outside. Russell, Russell. Could it be? Oh, it's this guy. You again, fools who try to take over my territory? Take it over. This part, don't even joke about that. Don't lie to me. You looked like that garbage bin a second ago. That garbage bin is part of my brunch course. The leftovers in it are all mine. I won't give any of it to you. Now look here, why the hell would I... Hm, get out, just get out. What a conceited bastard, I won't stand for this. Don't think so. I said it in the most condescending tone I could. I don't think so. How foolish to defy me, Master Ho Beep. Appear, my pets. Woof, woof, woof. Woof, woof, woof. Huge group of doggies gathered. Dude, he reminds me of uh, the doggy ninja guy from Sendoku. <laughs> Who had doggy familiars, too. You know? Cute. Now, Kisara Dono, don't let your guard down. These doggies are our enemy. Sick em. Okay, first doggy. Why are they all injured already? Ha! Kisara ran to the enemy and kit. Kuh. That hurts, but... <laughs> One stamina. Are you joking? Alright, I'm gonna hurt your doggies. Sorry. Not trying to kill them. <sighs> nice dodge. Nice heal. Ooh. Denry's getting low. Die, doggy. Alright, one down. Oh, Denry has healing too? Oh, wait, I think I remember reading that. Denry and Athena have healing, but Kisara doesn't. Oh my god, you killed the doggy, dude. Denry, <laughs> you're just scaring it. Ooh, Kisara's injured, and that's not gonna... The lunch won't heal her, I think. Anyways. I guess Denry will always attack the doggies if we knock them out. Ooh. Denry. What are you doing, bro? You're trolling. Probably should be attacking this dog. It has eight power. The other one only has one. Here we go. At least... The doggies probably won't die with Denry sleeping. These guys are strong. Maybe it was a mistake. 
Well, now we Ooh, this... Yeah, that's a Banger attack. Alright. Let's go then. Nice. I wouldn't mind killing you. I don't care about farming. Stop! So scary. Why are you using your shitty kit? Use your cards. Okay, nice. Oh, we killed him. Beast. <laughs> Wasn't trying, but now we definitely can farm the casino. Tragic. It's a level. Oh. Gotu's corpse faded from sight and was blown away by the wind. Master Hobeep Gotu, huh? What a refined man. You think so? I just thought he smelled. <laughs> okay, well. The go-to rivalry has ended. Let's do this stuff first. Well, we won't be fighting anything, so I guess we can just use the item. I guess sandbox items. Lunch. I can't use that here. Joke, apparently it's not just that. Alright, let's do... Walking path. Seems like a nice lunch spot. Uh, papa trees, items, lunch. Where do I use this? Oh, I guess I can just use this here, right? Master, we only have one lunch. Do you still want to eat it? Want to eat it? What should I do? I'm gonna eat it. Then we freaking Cade, so it's a good time to use it. Yeah, this is a good place. Why not make this lunchtime? Athena, spread the sheets. Yes, sir. It's lunchtime, right? Munch, munch. Athena 2.0 took two vinyl sheets from her bed and laid them on the ground. Aw, cute. Possible thumbnail. Munch, munch. Mmm, this is good. I feel so happy. Mmm, yeah, it's pretty good. You made this, right, Kisara? Yes, I'm happy to see you like it. I thought it might be a little too spicy. It isn't. It tastes good. Let's see how this eyeball roll tastes. The four of us sat in a circle and ate the lunch Kisara and Athena 2.0 made. Onigiri, onigiri. Genry, you little. Everyone gets three omelets. You like them that much? Here, have mine. Our seminar recovered fully after the fun meal. Phew, that was pretty good. I'm foals. I'm quite satisfied. I'm glad everyone liked it, right, Athena Chan? Yes, mm. Alright. Nice. All right. I want to see what our items do, though. I know System God can do it, right? Item explanation. So, Saragans are just for scammy, right? For your party. Okay, so it heals everybody's scammy. Oh, okay. Oh, maybe it doesn't heal everyone, but you like the whole party, it works the same. Okay, interesting. So some items will be alley specific. Um, what's Yomishu's do? I've never seen something like this. What is it? Oh yeah, this is a brand new product by um Happiness Pharmaceutical, so system might not know it. Mm, let me tell you, this is a new drug Hermes Hap This is a new drug Happiness Pharmaceutical. It's currently developing the Yomishu. It can recover what certain can your HP. Okay. That does sound like an amazing drug. If it's completed, the number of people who die from injuries and accidents will probably decrease. And if that happens, my job might be... might get a little easier. Hmm? Why is that? Because people will stop saving and loading frequently. Hey, don't call me out. Alright, so Yomishu's are how we heal. So we might need that. Hey, explain this. Oh, what a cute shovel playing in the sand, Ransom. We should, we should have done this with all the items. We kind of missed a chance. Interacting with System God. Because we even interacted with Willis a lot. Willis and... Oh, what was the tiny one in Rance 4? For some reason, it's Merkel in my mind, but it's definitely not Merkel. It Millie! No, wait, Millie's the... 
girl from Cat Town. Oh, whatever. She does. I don't know if she's gonna be back. Hopefully, she is because I kind of liked her. But, but yeah, we haven't really talked with System Dot a lot, so it's nice. Like I would do something so childish. The shovel won't do though. You can't truly play in the sand with that. What do you mean truly play? I mean sand battles between international pro sand athletes wielding shovels and buckets they can boast about. The pro sand scene. Then that's real. I can low key see that. Like imagine like two people battling off, they make their forts, make their traps. They can only use like sand and maybe like specific um materials everyone has or something. That sounds actually kind of dope. <laughs> Regular sand can't stand the pressure of the shovels they use. That's they're that amazing. I'm probably looking it up. And it's probably not real, so <laughs> one can dream. It's all about what shovel you use. Shovels forged by master artisans can be amazingly expensive. How asinine. <laughs> I, I, I appreciated it. Bucket. Hey, explain this. Oh, it's sand in that bucket. It's from the Totary Sand Dunes, isn't it? She knows her stuff. You know this sand? It's very famous sand. It's valued for its beauty everywhere in the world. You think... People care about I guess sand quality is a thing. The only special sand I know is... I remember when I was a kid, my grandmother gave me, like, a bottle of white sand, and she said it was, like... She got it from some other country. I don't even remember now, but I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. I don't think I have it anymore, but... <laughs> I guess I had my special sand as a kid, too. The Totary Sand Dunes are... Purveyors of sand to 80% of the world's royal palaces. So it's world famous sand? Yeah, why is world famous sand in a kid's playground, dude? Shut the glue. Hey, explain this. It looks like it's a, it looks like a strong glue. Once it hardens, I don't think you can do anything about it without a blade. Should I try it out? No matter where you stick me, I can just disappear, you know? What? Well, that's lame. Okay, it's like Gorilla Glue. I don't know if you have that in non-Canada. <laughs> I might as well save since I'm here. It's like our Super Glue brand. We also have Gorilla Tape. It's pretty good. It's actually a good product, but I also just like it because it's called Gorilla. Oh, that reminds me. Look up the playthrough. See if glue is what we need. Uh, rant. 4.2 walk through. My voice feels so weird today. Not as uppity. Mm, you're in the base. A few things to know about the dungeon up front. You may discover a blue item. It is a required item. Use it later in the dungeon, but if you have not found the blue, by a certain point of the story, you can go back to Doharis's happiness pharmaceutical to get it from him. Right. Oh, this also just reminded me. We still have, uh, we still have to get the aid from the nest. <laughs> so let's do that. So apparently, if we go to the stone wall and take the stone now, there's no point in taking these rocks, hmm? This stone is exactly the same size as an Udon aids. I see, you might be able to use this to fool an Udon. Which is the big bird thing. I took the stone that looked like a Udon aid. Hmm, I might want one of those too. Thought you already got your stone. He wanted it for Pitlin, eh? Um, it's in Walking Path. We go up the Papa tree. Trade rock for aid. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alright, I'll trade the aid with the stone that looks like it... <clears throat> yeah. Though it's not in the best condition for this. <clears throat> sorry. <clears throat> Actually, sorry. One second. Yeah, it's a little stuffed. I'll probably still go until like 40, 45 minutes though. Keep it a little short. Alright, I'll trade the nade with the stone that looks like it's the parent Udon in the sky, it doesn't find out. 
That, that sentence made no sense. I'm pretty sure I just royally fucked that up. Need to reconcentrate. Now, whoosh, I swiftly swapped the aid for the stone. All right, the udon has noticed, right? I obtained an udon aid. Hehehehe. <laughs> it looks good. Well, I obtained this aid, so I just have climbed down. Side slide, I descended the papa tree. I kind of feel bad for the, the udon, but gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, I know it's kind of redundant, but let's go check what system got us to say. Eight. Hey, explain this. An aid? Is this an udon aid? <laughs> That's exactly what it is. It's my favorite. Udon aids can certainly be used in many recipes and have great nutritional value, but are you really going to eat it? Of course. And just so you know, I'm not sharing it with you. If you warm it up, a chick might hatch. You're still going to eat it? Shut it. The poor Udon. I feel for you, kind of. I mean, I feel more bad for the mother, not for some reason. This is you. I eat AIDS. <laughs> not, I wouldn't say as recently, but like... Maybe like once every two weeks, which is totally like not recent at all, but still. It's like... Just feel free to the mom. Like, what if she's, like, nurturing the stone for a while? It's weird. <laughs> Anyways. Good tech, good tech. Get out of here. Yeah, jeez. We're back in business. All right. Maybe I should just double check. Just because, you know, we might as well take care of all of the business outside. I think we're good, though. Oh, oh yeah, we missed something in, uh, point B. Like, we found the Tian Tian medals in the cabinet, but if you look one more time, you get uh, another book. Oh, wait, apparently you need the book for the tank. <laughs> I'm just doing a quick reading. Uh... Okay, I have no no idea what's happening, but apparently this is all like an optional thing with uh what we're doing, the whole book into fish chain thing, but we'll do it. So let's go back. We can only go through the sandbox still, and let's let's get a little bit more action in this team. And wait, refrigerator. <laughs> there we go. Enter. You don't need to come get out of here. All right, so we don't have to go to the Redler route, even though we still have places to go. But that's fine. Let's head to the B entrance. open apparently we need to go back to the cabinet that's why you always double tap but I I always forget that huh all right if I'm gonna open a drawer if the drawer can be opened open it uh, I open it hmm oh there is a difficult book inside hmm fraud cosmology looks like a hard book but I guess I'll take it I obtained a difficult book Oh man, <laughs> I don't know if this is annoying, but now that I found out about the future, I'm gonna repeatedly use it. Hey, explain this. Let's see here. Fraud cosmology. You read difficult books, don't you, Ransom? It's not mine. I found it. What the heck is fraud cosmology, anyway? It's the study of fraud space. Space is a concern frauds. Space is seen by frauds. A book by frauds and for frauds. Oh, whatever. I never read a book without illustrations like this. <laughs> Based. I only read books with pictures. Fraud cosmology, huh? What would that even mean, bro? <laughs> Just imagining that. Doesn't really matter, though. Uh, let's. Oops. Yeah, we can't go through there. 
So now we go this way. Trade and fly room. But we actually go to sailor room. Right? Yeah. Then we go to the tank items. Difficult book. Come to think of it, I don't need a difficult book like this. Let's all throw it away. Splash, I threw the book in the water tank. Why would I, of all people, be carrying around a book like that? Hmm, why? Hmm, hmm. Randstone, the tank's a little strange. What is it? All of the creatures inside. As Drenry said, all of the macros had been happily swimming around moments before I'd floated up to the surface dead. What the heck? <laughs> They're dead because of that troublesome book. I can't imagine they died from the book, but maybe the ink used in it is poisonous to the macros. That's kind of sad. Bye bye, fishies. True. Bro. I don't know if it's because of the book, but in there, all of the macros are dead. And these aren't earth macros, these are like piranhas. <laughs> Bruh. Nah, it's not the ink, man. The fraud cosmology is like a holy bible. It put its wrath to the fishers. Anyways, let's take the key now. It's okay. I'm going in. I think this is the same. Blub blub, got the key. Alright, get back out here. Yes, sir. Athena 2.0 took the key and left the tank. I'm all wet. It's cold, but I got the key. Yup. Obtain the key in the water. Oh, thank you, thank you. And now we have to do it again. <laughs> um, there you go. I hope we get more system dot interaction in the future. I wonder if there's there's interaction in the past games and I just never noticed. Water key. Hey, explain this. It's an awfully tote key, huh? Is it a little wet? Well, I had it in my mouth. Ew, that's dirty. What? Why are you acting like I'm dirty? Hm, I lied anyway. It's wet because it was inside a water tank. Oh, good. She's really relieved? I mean, normally people would, but I mean, Lance is like the greatest man in the world, so I understand his frustration. <clears throat> so now we use this key on one of the doors. Actually, don't. it's not RR. RR is where we killed all the civilians, so it has to be R, since it's the only door we haven't opened. B door. Wait. R. Wait. How do I even get into RR? No! Oh wait, RR leads into BR, you just go here. Okay, I understand. I was confused. Why was, why was it RR? But... <clears throat> it's just the map, dude. Alright, let's go to R then. See if this works. Side quest completes. Oops. Uh, outdoor. Items. Water key. Wonder if I can use this key. I slipped the water key into the keyhole. Alright, it fits. Clank, I turned the key a little and heard the sound of the lock unlocking. You did it, Randstono. Now we can get inside. Yep. Alright. This... We'll check. Opening the door to this is dangerous. I put my ear inside and checked. Oh, I've got a key in La La. Right. And Melina's, uh... Melina's the... The girl they mentioned that a uh, pharmaceutical quote unquote kidnapped or something, so maybe we'll get some lore through here. <laughs> through door. Alright, let's go inside. Clack, we opened the door and headed inside. The room we entered was completely different from any other room we'd seen so far. Kia, who's there? The maid who was in the room panicked and fled to the other side of the bed when we entered. My name's Rance. I'm Athena 2.0. The name's Denry. I'm Kisara. Oh, I'm Ponky the Maid. 
What a name. <clears throat> the maid bowed politely at us. Pleased to meet you. Hmm? So what's this room for? It looks pretty different. Is this the Angel Army's boss's room? Um, could you people possibly be intruders? Yup. <laughs> Yuppers. <gasps> then you're terrible demons who thoughtlessly kill people and monsters. The maid backed up, trying to get it as far as away from us as possible. But please don't kill me. If you say so. Oh no. I think I draw this room on the map. Yes sir, what should I call it? Sorry, double glit. <laughs> What's this room anyway? It It's Walina Sam's room. So she says. Yes sir, righty righty. When Lena, not Walina, when Lena. Ah, so this is a holy doll monster of Walina's room, eh? How fancy. Of course it is. She's important after all. And you're her personal maid, huh? Yes, but Walina... When Lena Sama was kidnapped, so... Hmm? Well, whatever. You can be my maid from now on. Curly in Wen's room. <clears throat> okay. It's a fancy room. There's an exit in the south. Maid. Check. She seems to be a personal maid for this room. I guess her name's Ponky. She's not beautiful, but I guess she's okay to look at. I give her about 60 points. Aww. Poor Ponky, dude. I mean, six, a 6 out of 10 is not bad, IRL, to be honest. Talk. Hi, Ponky. Hey. <gasps> Please don't kill me. The maid is too frightened to hold our conversation with. So? Alright, well then, let's do it. Do what? Sets, of course. Take that! I pounced on the maid. I flipped the maid's skirt and stripped her panties, swiftly pushing myself right in. <gasps> Ha 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 ha. This is great. Sets me to sure nice. But I'm a normal. <laughs> Would a normal maid get this way? You're sets maid. Ah, no, no. I had fun raping her. <laughs> no CG. Poor Ponky. But thank you for not making me have to edit. Well then, I'll just get out of here again, me. You'll break, you'll break Ponky, dude. Nope, this is mine. Oh, I'm... Can I talk to you now? Guess she's... Guess I didn't break the ice. Ooh, you think we can give her an egg? Want this egg? Huh? This is an udon egg. Wait, is this actually the answer? Yeah, isn't it nice? Um, may I have this? I'm sure something good will happen if you give it to me. Why? Well, I don't know. Hmm, well, I guess so. I gave the maid the udon egg. Wait, now I need a chat. I don't know. You see maid, you're like, oh, maybe she can cook it for us. <laughs> um, oh. That's actually really good. Okay, don't touch the self-destruct device. Hey, the max potential from XP from fights will be doubled from this point on. Yo, value, actually. And apparently if you use, um, the shovel, you get two Kian Kian Meadows. That's good. Okay, cool. So that's actually a big boost, man. That's probably, like, I mean, it's not as good as the, the Super Ice Bird Sword, but if you miss that, then you're definitely missing out. Because in this game, I mean, you, you probably know, but just for people who don't remember, XP is not like a set thing, like you just feed a certain amount so you get a certain amount of XP. It's literally just random, so raising the random bar is really nice. So thank you. Thank you, Ponky. You're popping off. Love to see it. Wall painting. Check. There's some kind of incomprehensible painting on the wall. Really now? Okay. Alright, Athena, we're taking this painting. What is it? It looks like a guy with a phone or something. Okay, we're taking it. Athena 2.0 tried to take the painting on the wall, but the maid stopped her. You can't. When Lena, when Lena Sama loves that painting, please don't take it. I'm begging you. I see. Then I won't. Thank you. But I'll damage it. 
Huh? I ripped the painting open with the tip of my sword. Aw, you're such a f asshole sometimes. <gasps> you're terrible. How could you do something like that? Ha 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 ha. But he's so lovable, man. How can you stay mad when he ga ha 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 loudly in people's faces? <laughs> Alright, rip painting, I guess. Fireplace. Check. This fireplace is the very picture of boor bourgeoisie. Rich people have these, huh? I prefer a traditional sunken hearth. These stonemate things just seem so chilly. I want a fireplace if I ever get a house. <laughs> My grandparents have one, though they switched to um an electronic fireplace later in the years, just as you know, cleaning a real fireplace and stuff is pretty annoying. Well, electronic ones, like, it's not like, it's like our fireplace, but it's like powered by electricity. So that's sick, but yeah, fireplaces are actually sick, man. Don't diss them. <laughs> but fireplaces are warm. Yeah, shut up, Genry. What do you know? Oh, wait, we need to, <laughs> we need to do stuff. Enter. Athena, check if there's Santa Claus's corpse in the fireplace. Huh? Why? Apparently, they're fairly common. Santa Clauses who come in through the chimney and burn to death in the fireplace. Oh, they're a monster here. <laughs> or a species. There might be presents it was carrying inside. Anyway, check it out. Yes, sir. Presents, presents. Athena took one rummage around in the fireplace searching. Cough, cough. There's nothing there. <laughs> Tuh, no fun. That actually made sense, though. A Christmas-type enemy that delivers presents and maybe kills boys who have been naughty. <laughs> Anyways, finally can use the shovel. I dug up the some of the cinders in the fireplace with the shovel. Did did? Hmm. What's this? I discovered two meadows in the fire in with pictures of can cans on them in the fireplace. Between two meadows. Nice. Apparently that. Oh wait, we have this. Check. Huh? What's this button? It's a self-destruct the strut device. It is just so that when Lena Sama may push it if she ever becomes tired of living. What? <laughs> Dude, that's actually based. She is living the life, man. A fireplace? And she can just explode herself whenever she wants. <laughs> An explosion big enough to destroy this entire base and everyone else inside will occur, so please don't push it. A self-destruct device. But if when Lena Sama pushed this, wouldn't everyone in the base die too? Yes, but we're all prepared to join when Lena Sama at any time. True cult. I mean, you know we have to. But let me save real quick. <laughs> Actually, we might as well uh check what um but she has to say about the Kian Kian meadows. He explained this. Oh, it's not a meadow. It's a plastic octagonal meadow for sure. The Kian Kian picture is cute. Is this meadow from an arcade somewhere? An arcade, huh? Okay, let's save. 1 a.m., dude. And I mean, we gotta. I slowly approach the button on the self destruct device. Ah, no, don't push that. Randstono! I want to do what people tell me not to. That's a trait all humans share. Seriously, push it. I'm doing it! Push- I push the self-destruct device. True Chad energy. Oh, Athena- even Athena is dot dotting. Even Kisara. Boom. Game over. Oh, that was the best friends game yet. Thank you guys for watching 4.2. Hopefully you enjoyed the series. Next time we'll see what happens in K- I'm joking, by the way. I was actually hoping for the still theme on Game Over, but I guess, uh... Obviously that's not the case in this game. Anyways, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. Ended it with a bane, literally. But, yeah. I guess this episode was more of a cleanup episode, because we just did a lot of shit, um... We missed plus a side quest thing, but 
still progress nevertheless. Hopefully you enjoyed, and next time we'll, uh, we'll actually find some, well, I mean, we did see new areas, but we'll see more new areas, hopefully, and start, start taking down some more of the sailor monster gals and uh, the assassins. But yeah, thanks again for watching, see you next time, bye!